This one will go. You feed it birds here, and then power comes out. Stupid. My name is David. I'll be your guide. On the last episode, I fixed the floor and this glorious 71 Mustang. Today, I'm gonna be working on the doors. They're too heavy. We need to get out. Take pleasure in gutting you, boy. So say wait, so I can go faster, stronger, harder. Since last time I also done some other stuff like uh, some rust repairs. I've gone around and fixed most of the major rust like the door jams and the door pillar on the driver's side. Also both back parts of the roof skins. Smooth. There's of course a lot of rust left to do but I'm just gonna leave it for now. There's some reasons I wanna do this. The doors are really heavy. One tiny Swede equals 69.1. <laughs> Oh, shit. 109. 22. So that equals into about one eternity later. 40 kilos. What's that in? Silly weight. That's about 88 pounds for one door. Door handles suck. I don't want the locks. Also want to put in plastic windows, but there are some issues with doing that because these doors don't have any frames. This kind of just flop around. I can't just attach Lexan to nothing. So the idea is to cut the doors out, the inner section, all the way around. Get rid of the window mechanism, the door handles, and all of this junk to save some weight. And uh, because it's uh, unnecessary garbage. What I'll be doing is building a frame so I can attach the plastic windows. I'm just gonna use this. Let's go. I'm just gonna ask for a quick favor. The YouTube algorithm really thrives on attention and uh, engagement. So, like, subscribe, leave a comment, and the uh, video will get seen by more. We have a frame. Now that the frame is in place, I can remove all the stuff. Door is clean, all useless junk. Junk. Now we'll be cutting out all the unnecessary sheet metal because I also want to be able to pull my roll cage out into the door skin. So get it as far out as possible. If I, for chance, just flip this car five times over. It's nice to have the extra security. Like this. And down, and back here, here stitch all this, useless, crap. I still need to make some pieces so I can attach the Lexan in the in the bottom all the way over. Attach it to here, weld it all the way, grind it flat, make it nice. Also need to fill in these pieces.
Oh, no frame! So attach the legs onto. So now I can put in a plastic window. Might still need to adjust it a bit, but it's gonna be fine. Now that I've filled in the door handle, I'm gonna make my own. I made this. Let's drill a hole, yes? There we go, door handle. Perfect! I'm just gonna make something to cover this area. I'm gonna put in more rivets later on. Now we got the final issue. This is even holding up together. It's uh, very, very loose. Some super glue is going to fix this, yes? Oh yes. So I'm gonna dismount the door and um, start fixing the rust. Love rust. Rust repaired. So, made a lot of new pieces. And even the bottom corner. Not the prettiest ever, but it will work. kilos per door that's not bad not bad at all it's like half me with two doors
everything painted. Looks nice. Door opening mechanism in place. Very, very pretty. Now that everything is, is done, I'm gonna fit the windows nicely. I'm gonna make this rear section. So I'm gonna make similar to this, but in the rear, just a solid one. Rivets, rivets, rivets. Rivet. I'm just gonna do some cleanup. Rivets. Yep. Get in, slam the door, perfect, you can open the window, wave at the crowd, pull the wire to get out, ah. no, failure, second attempt, yes, <laughs> Brilliant, oh yes. Let's close the window, oh yes. I live here now. Next time I'm gonna be fixing the trunk. Uh, it's rusty as hell. It's gonna be great.